Zero skill, maximum profit. been pretty slow, not gonna lie.
Beetlejuice is, if you go out wear a medical grade face mask, actually, uh, I don't know if you've been paying attention, but you're adult. Medical officials came out actually this morning stating, do not wear a face mask. Like, it does nothing. Face masks primarily help if you are sick and you want to stop the spread of what you have. It's it's not the opposite of people like, oh, I'm not going to get sick if I wear a face mask. In reality, it's not true at all. And what medical officials are saying is it sucks because the face masks are sold out everywhere. And now people who are sick and need them to stop spreading their, their sickness you can't get them. <laughs> because people are morons. So there you go. Saturday Night Smackdown, right? Because, <laughs> uh, you know, last night we had a double new release. It obviously made sense to play the double new releases on new release day, uh, which, you know, brought in attention, and people checked them out and liked them, by the way. It worked out well. People, both new releases seem to be intriguing and interesting, and tomorrow we'll be playing them both again, both Ghostwire Tokyo and Caribbean The Forgotten Land. Now, this shocks um, me. But it obviously threw the schedule off a little bit because normally I would play Old School Street Fighter on Friday night, and obviously that didn't happen, so we're doing it tonight, okay? Uh, now, I will preface this <clears throat> with a few things. I don't care. First of all, when I play Old School Street Fighter, I have to pay attention to the game. Duh. If I'm not paying attention to the game, what am I playing a competitive game for, right? That'd be pretty stupid. Blah, 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 um, it's very time-consuming. Uh, very attention-seeking. I have to pay attention blah, 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 um, If I'm on a streak of events, it could be challenging for me to do things like interact with you guys when you're tagging me in the chat or shout-out contributions. I absolutely do my best to try to shout-out contributions as soon as I possibly can, but I don't always do the best job of it, and I apologize for that in advance so that if you are, like, saying, oh, I did a super chat or I did a tip and Phil's not saying anything, it's probably because I'm immersed in the game. Feel free to try to, you know, remind me in the stream chat of what's going on so I don't miss people. But I do my best to to update the leaderboard and shout everyone out as soon as I can on a Friday Night Fights stream. Of course, today it's Saturday. Um, now, in addition, <clears throat> excuse me. In addition, um, I already ha uh, spoke with Jax Raxer today. Earlier today, he was on the first stream, actually, uh, for the pre-stream podcast. And he said that he's going to try to make it tonight. <clears throat> Normally, he, he's here for every Friday Night Fights, but he might not make it tonight. He already sent me a nice, generous contribution on the first stream. So, I know people will be freaking out. Where's Jax? Oh, my God. Jax is here. Jax. Jax. No, he's probably not going to be here tonight. Uh, so, there's not going to be any, any, you know, contribution or anything from him. I know it's a staple. He's here almost like, every time, right? So, I'm just saying that in advance to not try to curtail the drama here. People, oh, where is he? Oh, is he okay? He's fine. He's just, you know, it's a Saturday. It's a different day for him. It's, he's, he's busy. Okay? Um. And lastly... I want to give a quick shout out to Harmless Tiger, who actually tipped me during my break between streams and said, I missed your Kirby stream, so I hope you enjoy the game. So far, I love the game. The first two hours were an insanely good experience. Positive as hell, fun. I don't think I have a single complaint about the game so far, besides maybe I wish the graphics tiger, were slightly tiger, better ooh, in the frame rate department ooh, ooh, runs on the tiger, Switch. Just ooh, little choppy ooh, parts. Um, <clears throat> but outside of that, it's a great game. I cannot wait to play it more tomorrow. All right? So... Tomorrow's streams will be Ghostwire Tokyo continuing on the first stream and Kirby and the Forgotten Land on the late stream. Monday streams will be Elden Ring on the first stream, and Monday night stream is completely up in the air. It could be more Kirby, it could be more Ghostwire, or we could do Skyrim. I'm going to likely do a poll uh, overnight to determine what game ends up being the late stream on Monday, and that will probably go up sometime tomorrow, okay? <clears throat> Should be good, all right? Uh, I'm not here Tuesday. This week, the main streams will be a balance between Ghostwire Tokyo and Elden Ring. The late streams will be a balance between Kirby and me not streaming because I know I'm going to have to take at least one or more streams off this week to do my taxes. It just has to be done at this point. We're running out of time for me to file them, so I have to do it, okay? <clears throat> so that being said, uh, please understand, 
I will do my best to be here as much as I can this week on the late streams, but there's no guarantee when I'm going to be here because it depends on how long this takes, okay? All right. Also, oh, reminder, go. this week is going to be exciting WWE because champions. it's my She's birthday week. Shit. Uh, I'll have nice New decorations and everything shit. on the streams. How about this? Uh, including, like, some balloons this? and streamers and the like. WWE and champions. if contributions come in that are, right. that are relatively big, I'll do, like, something WWE special. Like, maybe champions. do a noisemaker or a party horn. I'm actually going to see what they have uh, when head. I have my day off on Tuesday. I don't think see what about WWE champions. You do. And uh, you probably should be a good week. It's all leading up to my birthday on April 6th. I'm not exactly sure what I'm doing yet. I might do a marathon. I might do something special. All right? Should be a good time. All right. Without further ado. Let's boot her they up. Said, Phil, Let's you know, we, we can find competition to you, this week. But it always remember, seems like it's a black hole. Two weeks ago, it always seems when like I played no this on PlayStation, it was you're very still slim pickings. Problems. I could you're barely find debt, anyone. And, and that had been my return week to Street I agree Fighter. With likely you. it's because I hadn't played it for like a month that many people had fallen off playing it. So let's see how this goes. What was for dinner? We had uh, just just pasta with a spicy marinara sauce. It's called arabata. Nothing too special. We love, you know, we love pasta. I'm Italian. Come on now. <clears throat> All right. So, got, by the way, guys, uh, one thing I totally forgot to say. Please, tonight, if you enjoy Street Fighter and you like that I still do it, please like the stream. We're going for 100 likes on tonight's stream. It helps with engagement Kings, on the Kings, channel. Kings. It gets this channel more exposure. Please like the stream. In addition, please support the stream. Right now, there's no support at all. That's okay. We're just getting started. It would be great. Especially some tips. Remember, I need hundred dollars to really raise do. tonight. I, need that I put money. on the M bills. Bison hat. And we go on a tear with M Bison. All right. Cool. All right. Here we go. Whew. Okay. We've got some uh, lobby set up. Let's see if I can jump into one. There we go. It's been pretty slow. Not gonna lie. I am Polish, but I am a quarter Polish, a quarter Italian, and half just kind of a, a mix of European. Because my mom is 50-50, half Polish, half Italian. So, but my dad is a big mix. Doll Seems Elephant, hello. How you doing? He says, I forgot you were doing this on Saturday. Good to see you. Thank you. Good to see you, Doll Seems Elephants. Welcome. <laughs> Can I talk about my competitive days in Street Fighter? No, I refuse. <laughs> if you have something specific to ask, absolutely. But I need to know exactly what you'd like to talk about. Is it just me, or... Didn't this used to be a different background? Didn't we used to do, um... The one where it was more, more zoomed in? Maybe I'm just going crazy, but I swear at one point I had it more zoomed into this. This is fine. I can still play it, but I swear it used to be more zoomed in. Maybe I'm just going to lose my mind. I'm going to stretch out the leaderboard a little bigger. There we go. And I know I didn't change the settings either, so I don't know, I don't know why it would be different. 24 fucking 7? Do I know any good Polish dishes? Uh, we used to have kielbasa all the time. Kielbasa with all uh, like fried onions, pierogies. My mom used to make homemade pierogies filled with a delicious uh, potato and cheese mixture in the middle. And also, she would fry it out with onions, too, now that I'm thinking about it. <laughs> Fried onions was a very, uh, very uh, popular uh, ingredient in Polish cuisine. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my weekly session of Old School Street Fighter called Friday Night Fights, except I'm playing it on Saturday this week. So it's actually Saturday Night Smackdown. All right, you two Who do I start on. with this week? Let's start with... Uh, you know what? I, like, never play with Ryu. Let's start with Ryu. Why not? I never picked with you. Okay. Oh, that was a great show you can right there. Destroy. What's up, Haseo? Haseo says, thanks for playing Old School Street Fighter. No problem. I love doing this. You know that. Haha, <laughs> dizzy already. That was sure you can. Uh, monster delay on everything. I love it. It's all good. I 
gotta get the hand. There we go. There we go. Tor you gets. Hit him with those Tor you gets. And Goji Tanks is here. I'm not wasting my time. You guys know about that fucking idiot stalking me everywhere and has the worst connection ever. Not even gonna waste any time. Daniel, my late night streams usually stream till roughly 9 15 p.m. Pacific time. Sometimes I go a little later. Sometimes I stop a little earlier. It all depends on the situation. Uh, in recent weeks, sadly, I haven't really found enough competition to do this all night. And when I do that, I usually um, will do a little Q&A or something afterward. Show Ryukin. What's up? We haven't seen Show Ryukin in a long time. If you remember, a couple of years ago, I used to play regularly against Show Ryukin uh, on these Friday Night Fight streams. And he is a very good Dudley player in Street Fighter 3 Third Strike. And I haven't played him in a million years, and now he's back tonight, so that's kind of good. Alright, we got the Akuma baby. Or I should say Akuma. Yeah, well, I got the Yuri. Retirement Slaughter Yuri. Are you ready? Go! Thanks to Jobbity Bobbity for joining the Hate Army! Oh, there's a lot of lag. It sucks. You're getting away with a lot of stuff. Oh, what the fuck? He has zero health. Zero. And he bashes low jab and it hits me. Why'd I get hit there? I didn't dash back. I did not do that. Whoa! It dropped my input completely. Oh my god. Yeah, the connection against this guy sucks. Grab some salt. Bullshit. Oh, come on! I didn't do... Dude, it's seriously not giving me my moves. This sucks. I'm dead. Yeah. That was really laggy shit. A lot of the times he was wide open and my move would drop right in the middle. And I'm like, dude, I can't keep up my pattern with fucking, uh, with, with, uh, Urien if my move drops. It dropped a ton of moves. Try a different room. Try to get back to this room now that fucking Goji Tank's left. <clears throat> Okay. What's up? Uh, let's see here. Derek, good evening. No, I didn't get I didn't get Saturday Night Smackdown for Friday Night Smackdown just because Smackdown starts with an S just like Saturday. It rolls off the tanks, oh, Derek. The only reason I, I called you that. <clears throat> Dave Baxter, I have no idea how good low tier God is, so I couldn't say. I've never even seen the guy play. Seriously. I think maybe people have said I played him once ever in Street Fighter 4. I don't remember the match, and I've never seen him play otherwise, so... I can't attest to the guy's skill to say anything about our comp competitive levels against each other. Jade, yes, I remember the, the silly DXP gimmick that I did for a little bit in competitive Street Fighter there near the end of my run. Yeah, Derek, someone else was here impersonating you earlier today. Which is why it's been confusing recently. There's been a, a, quite a few impersonators, and uh, I do my best to try to identify them, but sometimes I'm in the middle of a stream, I can't use a, a special tool or whatever figure out who's who it does take a bit to set it up um and uh earlier today someone was here of all things listen to this one they were here impersonating Derek, and they say during during elden ring phil would you ever use like some kind of linux on an operating system because i learned about it in, in a class i'm like why would Derek come to my stream and start talking so about gonna be an asshole PC operating system. like an asshole you're gonna be showing the door like <laughs> well i talk about the most random possible thing that's the one thing like why would he do that does not make any sense so i knew it wasn't him immediately The background on this level is six is Razorback Roar. This is one of the better backgrounds of Alpha 3. You get this when you either fight Bison as a boss fight at the end, or if you pick any of the secret characters, like Balrog as a secret character, 
in this game that you have to pick off the select screen with a special code. Whenever you get that, the super character fights on this stage and you get this music too. <laughs> Thanks for the money, stupid fuck. I know, Derek, you never, you never even attended an Elden Ring stream, right? You've said, all right, you're not interested in Elden Ring, which is why you're not around during the daytime stream. So that's why when this idiot shows up and tries to impersonate you, I'm like, you're not fooling anybody. Like... <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha Thanks for the money, stupid fuck! For DDM Internet Fund. Time over victory, oh my god. Go for it, man. says Goji Tanks entered the room and got mad laggy. I, be I believe you, Shoryuken. That fucking guy's connection is so terrible and he goes everywhere stalking me every time I play the game. I can't even have fun, man. Fun. Oh, this is such a boring fucking fight. Oh my god, look how boring this is. Atrociously boring. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Okay. Jesus. Uh, let's see. You picked the old Ken. Hmm. Old Ken with insanely fast fireballs. Tricky. I'll pick Blanco, although it's a terrible matchup for Blanco. <laughs> Yummy! I love to eat. Eat, eat, ten masters brain cells. Um, nom, 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 nom. <laughs> Special delivery. Special delivery. That's bullshit, because I did, I have a free throw there, and I couldn't get it because of the fucking lag. He gets a spammed uppercut instead. Nope, that was a hit and string. You cannot interrupt it with sure you can if it's coming out properly. So that's the bullshit net code. La 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 la. There we go. That's much more like it. Toiletered poop poop. Tim me three dollars asking for Vega gameplay. Well, toiletered poop poop. I'm not putting that fucking stupid ass name on my leaderboard. <laughs> Incredibly dumb. But if you want Vega, I'll play with Vega. If that's really what you want, I'll play with Vega a couple times. Why am I toxic? Yeah. Wow, this is a lag. Oh my god, yo, come on, it's so bad. No roll. I'm not getting any rolls. Jesus, this is how bad this is. What the fuck? Right in the middle of my combo, he just smashes punch and gets it. He hits me with it. What the hell? Dude, it's so laggy. Are you fucking shitting me? <laughs> right. Good. Fuck you. Take that, you laggy son of a bitch. <laughs> Take that! Jesus. Alright. 
This is the, the tournament color I used to pick with Vega all the time. The red and black. Flip. I didn't do that. Boom. Backdrop of legends. Oh, yeah. Didn't do the flip. What the heck? says, is Bison eligible tonight for the hat? If we get the hat tonight at $100 raise of tips, it's M. Bison time for a while. But we actually have to get there. Right now, we have $3 of tips, so I don't think we should really be talking about that and getting ahead of ourselves yet. New Saga? Dalton wants some new Saga. Alright. New Saga sucks, but I'll try him against Old Ken and probably a body. I was better at Justin Wong only in this game. I, I was not as good to do it. I don't have money 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 to do it. That was Tiger Uppercut. Didn't come out. Look, I, he's catching me with stuff that he's not hitting me with. It's so stupid. Yeah, he's hitting me with jump kicks that I'm not open, but the game's not allowing me to fucking block, so he's getting two hit combos for no reason. No Tiger Uppercut, I got jab instead. What? What's my fucking move? Yeah, look at this. He's getting sweeps he's not hitting me with. Yeah, I can't win now. There's no way. Can't get out of the corner. Yeah, it has nothing to do with him. It's the fucking online code sucks. He's fucking doing jump kicks, and I can't sh I can't tiger uppercut them. I get jab, and then I can't fucking move. I get stun locked for no reason because the fucking net code sucks and delays what you're doing. He's wide open. He cannot do the stuff he was doing. I can either uh, uppercut it on command, or I can block, and it wouldn't allow me to do either there because of the fucking stupid online play. Complete trash. New Sagat sucks anyway. Old Sagat is very good. New Sagat is terrible. He's got a, a lot of delay on his moves. And his, his uh, Tiger Uppercuts suck except the jab version. Every other version is terrible. Yep. Basic zoning. <sighs> what is going on? Yeah, I know Derek Shaw Yukin's really good. I want to play him, but I don't know if he'll be able to get into a room with me tonight. <clears throat> yes, I've had bison meat before in Naginta. I've had uh, bison burgers before. They're t quite tasty. They're way lean. They have almost no fat in the meat. The meat is full of this unique flavor. It doesn't taste like beef at all. They're very good. I like bison burgers. I don't know the old beef code, actually. Oh, wow. Timed jumping roundhouse stuffed his jumping roundhouse. It's pretty funny. <clears throat> what the fuck? Okay, old Ken's jumping roundhouse kick is crazy good. He's got it's got a, a really long hitbox, but a more narrow hurt box compared to almost everyone else's jump kicks. And it does tons of damage. Like, tons. Congrats on Platinum and Spider-Man, uh, Kagome. 
Jade's is Broody guy again in backstories. Broody? I'm trying to remember. Broody, the Street Fighter Alpha 1. And wasn't he part of the Mad Gear gang? I think he's he's part of Final Fight, if I remember correctly. He was a, way, a lesser known character, I think. But I'm pretty sure he was part of the Final Fight crew, and then he premiered in fighting games in Street Fighter Alpha. No, I take that back. So, he was in Street Fighter 1 as a character, and it was rumored that he was part of the Mad Gear gang from Final Fight, but he was never actually in Final Fight as part of the Mad Gear gang. He was a character for Street Fighter 1. Now I'm remembering. And he made his debut in Street Fighter Alpha 1 outside of the, uh... I'm gonna try Zangief. Outside of the, uh... Uh, you know, uh, Street Fighter 1 appearance. That's right. <laughs> Oh, oh, suplex of legend. Stop this. Yes. Got him. The Geister. Very good. Das Geef. I don't know the old Geef code. I prefer new Geef because I like the green hand for certain situations. Excuse me. It's absolutely disgusting. I love this connection. The Ziggy Biggie is here. What the fuck? Oh my god. Jesus fuck lag. Oi. What the? It dropped my input completely. You should have been sure you can, or, uh, spinning pile driver regardless. Derek says, Bree looks so different in Street Fighter 1. People said he wasn't as buff and his skin tone was completely wrong. Yeah, they basically redesigned the character for putting him into Street Fighter Alpha 1. They completely redesigned him from the ground up. Like I said, originally he was supposed to be, I'm pretty sure he was supposed to be a Mad Gear Gang member. And then they redesigned him to be like a completely different, unique kind of character. Ugh, stupid Alpha 3. <laughs> Here we go with this. Guy and Gen's backstories. Guy was one of the three original characters of Final Fight. He's the, uh, the ninja style guy. Yeah, he's a ninja, and he's one of their three original characters. It's Cody, Hagar, and Guy, and they, they team up to fight against the Mad Gears. He's the only one without a personal investment, so if I remember correctly, the, the woman who gets kidnapped by the Mad Gears is the daughter of the mayor, Hagar, and the girlfriend of Cody. But Guy is just kind of like their buddy, and he wants to help them out, even though, like, he's not related or, or have any, he doesn't have any, any relation to the, to the kidnapping. I didn't do that at all. 
Not even close. I did low medium punch. The game says I did, I did dragon punch motion. I can't do I can't do double fireball motion. It doesn't come out. Look, it doesn't come out. Fucking lag. Why am I getting hit? I'm not open. I'm never, I'm seriously never open, but his random moves hit me because the lag is so bad I can't even just block. I got the rose perfect uh, special uh, wind pose. Very nice. Transforms. Very nice. So yeah, so Guy is actually just a nice guy helping out Cody and Hagar against the Mad Gears that are trying to take over Metro City. And he's a uh, you know a ninja style martial artist. Guess there's ninja schools around Metro City somewhere. <laughs> uh, backstory of Rose. Rose is just supposed to be some kind of a mystic magic user who hates M. Bison. She supposedly has some kind of history with M. Bison, although it's never really fully revealed what it is, at least in the old games. But she knows Bison and she's trying to hunt him down to stop him. No flame. Oh, no. No third punch. No, that's five missed moves in a row. Six. Seven. Seven missed moves in a row. The game won't give them to me online. <laughs> I can't get wake up flame kick at all. Yeah, I can't I could not get wake up flame kick once. There's like eight opportunities there to hit her. Can't get it. Doesn't come out. I'm, I'm not doing anything. I'm literally holding back. Wow. Well, my super blows through you. Get the fuck out of here. Stupid lag, man. Kevin Bernstein, thank you for the super chat. He says, how is the best super turbo streamer doing? I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. How did you know I was the best? How did you know? What the fuck is this guy doing? <laughs> wow, what a moron. Guy. You just stood still. Paid attention, dumbass. By the way, the, the, when I beat the old Ken, he left, didn't he? He got fucking salty. I beat him with Zangief and he left. Fuck, uh, I almost said King Gokin. No, not King Gokin. Fuck Goji Tanks. I don't know why King Gokin, because he's not even here tonight. Fuck uh, Goji Tanks. Uh, yeah, apologies to King Gokin for even confusing uh, your name with the name of that jerk. Uh -huh. You don't deserve it. Kevin says I'm the only Street Fighter streamer he watches. I'm not surprised because there aren't a lot of variety Street Fighter streamers. Most people who play fighting games like this in stream literally just play fighting games in stream. That's about it. But... There's a few of us that are big variety. I know that Maximilian Dude does a lot of variety stuff. 
uh, but still has an insanely heavy focus on FGC stuff, while mine is like, I'm just casual, you know what I mean? Like, I'm good at the older stuff, but I'm just a casual player. I have no desire to play competitively. I'm not going to analyze fucking fighting games. I'm not going to be doing in-depth coverage of the new ones, you know what I mean? Uh, Toilet Turd Poop Poop did another tip. So I love Street Fighter. Do you think we could potentially get WWE 2K22 for Friday Night Fights? Speaking of wrestlers, did you see Kevin Nash's cameo on Rings of Redemption? No. And no. There you go. Blah, Eventually, blah, I will blah, play blah, blah, WWE blah, as a full playthrough, and I'll cover blah, all the different blah, modes blah, blah, and review some matches. Blah, 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 I'm not going to do it as Friday Night Fights. Blah, 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 Absolutely not. And I don't give two shits what he did with Wings of Redemption. The cameos are paid, silly videos where the person who's saying it literally has nothing nothing to do with or, or anything to do with the people they're talking to. They don't even know who they are. So who cares? Seriously, who gives a shit what they would say in a cameo? <clears throat> okay. Oh, we got a long wait. They're playing Alpha 3, guys. We got a long fucking wait. This shit takes forever when they play Alpha 3. <laughs> what do we have for dinner? We have pasta. Rigatoni pasta with spicy marinara sauce and chicken meatballs. Nothing too out of the ordinary. Dalzim's Elephant says, can I bring back Minty Hawk? I guess I could. Which Man, which button is it, though? It's either Fierce Punch or Light Kick, and I can't remember which. The bummer about Minty Hawk is, although he looks better than Old Hawk, his uh, throw range is nowhere near as good, and his normals are nowhere near as good. It's kind of like a, a nerf to the character to pick Minty Hawk. Um, but if you really want me to, I can try. I gotta remember what it is. I think it's Fierce Punch. I think it is. Oh, uh, no. Any plans for Knights of the Old Republic 2? No time soon. I have it. If I ever want to play it, we can play it. But no, not anytime soon. Plus, I think I can just get it digitally on Xbox Series X anyway, right? It run better. Simon Saren, no, you're asking the wrong person. Any lore from Street Fighter 4 or further, I don't really know. I only, you know, I'm, I was heavily into the old school ones all the way up to Street Fighter 3. But after that, you know, Street Fighter 4, did I play it? Yes. Was I like a, a lore master who went through everyone's story modes and, ma and memorized all that? No. Absolutely not. I could probably tell you more about Jury's playstyle than I could about uh, her story. I don't know any like. I think she works for Bison. Uh, well, I know. Did I ever like William Regal as a wrestler? Oh, I think he's a good character, and I think he's a good technical wrestler, uh, Derek. I don't know much more about him than that. Never really saw him outside of just his WWE appearances. Jason, he does play a little bit of Street Fighter Five. Oh, you do. I, I never liked it, dude. Ap, ap, ap. When I like Never him, like it. <laughs> or <laughs> does that sound like ack, 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 ack? Minty Hawk is fierce punch. All right, yeah, I'll, I'll try it. Like I said, it won't be as, as effective as Old Hawk, but suplex. Yeah, I talked about this on pre-stream. Jax Raxer was already here earlier today. He showed up on pre-stream to say hello and say that he probably wouldn't be able to make it tonight, or if he does, he'll be very, very late. Uh, so he did actually contribute on my earlier stream. Uh, but yeah, that's why he's not here. I know he's a staple, and people wonder where he is when he's not here. Guitar Player, thank you for a tip. $4.20, and he says, I started playing Life is Strange True Colors. I'm really liking the game. I, I believe Life is Strange True Colors is as good as the original Life is Strange 1. I actually feel it's that good of a game. Um, Minty Hawk, there it is. Yeah, I actually feel it was insanely good. It was way better than 2. It was way better than Before the Storm. They like they they did a really good job bringing the series back to what it was known for, you know, and getting rid of the stupid bullshit. What the hell are you talking about? He's, oh my god, spinning Paul Dirt from that range. Good sweep. Good throw, good, this is a good throw match. He doesn't know how to stop it. Zangief can't stop the dive, but he doesn't know how to do it. I think a guitar player for that tip. I'll get up there on the leader when I get a chance. Super kick, super kick, super kick, super kick. 
Super kick. Oh, wait a minute. That's not fair. Take this. <laughs> Never get close to him. What are you thinking? You got close to a grappler. What did you think was going to happen? He was going to stand around and shake your hand? And... Thank you, guitar player. That will jump us up to $9 in tips so far tonight. Thank you. Ugh. Fucking Chun Li. Incred incredibly overpowered bullshit character in this game. She really is. Of course, you picked Exism, which sucks. Can't recover. Interesting. Punch the foot. Get that out of here. That was easy. Oh. Uh, Dalsim says, I like the, that color on, on Keyhawk, the minty color. He's a shame it's not the original. I know. It's too bad Original Hawk doesn't have that color scheme. Viseo says, we'll be checking out the horror game The Quarry in June. Of course. It's from the makers of Until Dawn. It's known to be the spiritual successor to that game. Right, we all know how good Until down. Dawn was. Oh, right? yeah, look at that. Oh, oh, More minty oh, Hawk. Oh, we got solid gold bison. Greg Kinnear did a super chat and Kevin just did a super chat. Thank you guys. Would you consider esports a valid sport like soccer? Is it is it a valid competition? Yes. Is it a sport sport? I guess it really depends on what you consider sports like. Would you consider chess sports too? You know what I mean? Yes, I'll take that trade. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. Super kick, baby. Wow, the animation for Kevin's Super Chat just showed up now. A match later. A whole match later. Wow. Okay. One more with Tiha. Derek, I have zero recollection of that. Haha, <laughs> that's like 11 years ago, man. The two hit dizzy was ridiculous. Two hits dizzy. Where's my combo? It stopped hitting. <laughs> the lockdown. Walked right into it. Very nice. <clears throat> Low smash. Jade is excited for tomorrow because I'm playing Ghostwire and Kirby again. Back to back. Should be a fun streaming day for sure. 
Where's the win streak counter? Skis TV, that's your guys' job to count the wins, right? I'm just playing. It's too fast for me to be counting wins. To <clears throat> be the Blanca. Blanca! Blanca's balls. Looks like a carrot. A furry Brazilian carrot. He gave up! He fucking gave up and walked forward, wow. Right into it. Why would you name a puppy Bounty Bar? Why are you naming puppies after uh after uh candy bars? <laughs> it's weird. Bounty bar. Derek, I too love the Kirby videos and Kirby in general. It's a great game. So far, so good. Two hours of outstanding stuff. What the? I want a head stomp. It gave me that kid put me in a bad position. Drop my input. Donk. Donk. The Ziggy Piggy's back. <laughs> he was pretty close, like point blank against the lightning legs. <clears throat> okay. Lol, no, took me $4.20 talking about that they beat Elden Ring today. It was a great battle, the final boss. I'm not going to read too much, I don't want him to spoil it, but he says uh, maybe some cami. Want some cami? Okay, we can do cami. Thank you to lol no tip. There we go. Question is, will my moves come out with him? <laughs> Hello, King. Good evening. Hello, Tyrone. It's been pretty slow. Not gonna lie. Yeah, moves are going out so far. Damn! <laughs> you know what to do. I love Hulk Hogan's dick. Jesus Christ! Wow! I was not expecting the bound to be over that fast. That was nuts. That was insane counter hit damage is what that was. Yikes. <clears throat> E Honda against Cami. Insane counter pick match. Round one, fight. The Wow! 
right. That's what he wanted. He wanted low fierce and get a perfect three hit combo. I need th that money. I really do. I need that money. Get my bills. What the fuck? out twice with both times that I did cannon drill I was trying to do thrust kick which would have hit his uh, torpedoes and I did not get it twice in a row it gave me the wrong move and that's it <laughs> <clears throat> that is it <laughs> I almost never do cannon drill very rarely would I do one it's only usually in the mid range and it's to trick them a little bit but yeah repeated wrong move repeated wrong move I'm not gonna come back from that that's also a fight where you can never do the roll if you do the roll, he just decides what it hits it right clean. Um, and that's why he counterpicked. Liter like, literally, that's why he counterpicked me. <laughs> Pansu Senpai. When I played competitively, who did I play with mainly? In Super Turbo, I played with uh, Vega, DJ, Balrog. Every once in a while, I would play like Old Sagat. And very rarely a character such as Honda. But usually it was Vega, DJ, or uh, Balra. <laughs> DJ Urian Nash and E Honda backstories. DJ is just a musician. He's, just a, he's a martial artist, but also a musician. And he wants to bring his music to the world. And he feels like if he gets famous for being a world famous fighter and a musician, like he'd be a unique combination. And so he's supposed to be like both at once. Urian, I don't really know Urian's backstory that well. I know he's related to Gil in some way, but I don't exactly remember how. I think he's part of a secret society or something, the same as Gil, but um, I don't remember exactly. Nash is just uh, the same as Charlie, the same character. It's supposed to be Guile's teammate from the Air Force. They go in on a mission to stop Bison at one point in Shadowloo, and they failed. He got captured, and uh, basically got mind controlled by Bison, turning him into that zombie creature that he is in Street Fighter V. E Honda is, is very simply put a sumo wrestler who wants to be the best fighter in the world and bring more notoriety to sumo in general. And he feels that if he enters a world tournament and he wins, that basically people will respect sumo more. Because I guess what they feel is that in, in cultural circles, blah, 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 some people respect sumo wrestling, but a lot of people can say it's not a real So he's trying to change that opinion by entering a Street Fighter tournament. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, here Again, we go. There's a bunch of hidden fees and champion. taxes when you use Uber Eats or DoorDash in your area. You, you can avoid their shit. hidden How fees, this? taxes, and issues How if you join this? their subscription-based program. Champions. Um, All right. Usually, you're absolutely right. If you go to order champions. food from there, not only is there a markup on the base menu, but they're like, oh, a special tax day. here. I for don't delivery think here, here, here. If you do their program, you it's like do. a flat rate a month of you like, like 10 bucks or something about like that. I have no idea. Usually, they take all that shit out. Loser! I don't even know what you're talking about. I don't know what that is, so I'm not going to answer that question. <laughs> yeah, Char Charlie uh, Nash is Charlie's last name. I, I think so. I have Charlie Nash. If I get down on my hands and knees, it's just weird that he was Nash in Japan, and they thought for some reason they couldn't call him Nash in America. I don't understand why. <clears throat> Or you can. Punch him in the nuts. Punch him in the nuts again. The lag is amazing. I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> Insanely laggy. Can I play with DJ, Yuri, and Nash, or E Honda? Well, there's no Nash, it's Charlie, right? But yeah. Oh, uh, Charlie! I don't know about speaking Charlie. He's not that good in, in Alpha 3. Uh, he was much better in Alpha 1. I feel like in Alpha 3, he's one of the worst characters. Except for stupid Vs and juggle combo, which I don't know how to do. You want some DJ? I'll some DJ. 
Wh what do I do? All right. Dance on your face. Super kick. Super kick. Right out of the sky. Beautiful. I know anyone who played with low tier teams and did well in Marvel vs. Capcom 2. The first two or so years of the game, yes. After that, no. Basically, after the first couple of years, everyone pussy. started picking the very top tier teams that included uh, characters like Storm, uh, you know, Magneto, Cable, Sentinel. And once those were out, it was like, forget it. Like, there was seriously no way to stop those teams without picking other top tiers. Tiger, Tiger, ooh, ooh, there was this guy. Ooh, tiger, ooh, I forget exactly where he was from. Was it Philadelphia? I'm trying to remember now. And he used to pick, they called it Team Big. And what it was was, look at this combo. It was uh, Juggernaut, Zangief, and Hulk. And there was a glitch where you could make their damage be dramatically increased in the game. And if you used it, you could do like a combo and kill an entire character with one basic combo. But, you know, at first was it effective? Yeah. Then everyone just figured out the top tier strategies to stop it and shut it down. And there was really no way to win with teams like that anymore, which is a shame. You know who I really liked in Marvel vs. Capcom 2? BB Hood from uh, Darkstalkers fame. She had a couple combos. You could do a couple hits into Super, and it would do ridiculous damage. And you could actually combo it with certain assists, and it would do ridiculous unscaled damage, just over the top crazy damage. But can't really hold a, you know, hold uh, tough fights uh, against the top tiers in that game. You have to pick a top tier to really hang. <clears throat> Sagat. Exism Sagat. Terrible. Wow. Jesus, it, did you see that fucking rollback code right there? Why did I get hit? That's fucking complete bullshit. I got hit for absolutely no reason. I wasn't even open. Stupid fucking game. That's much more fucking like it. Much more like it. Alrighty then. That's what we call first round bullshit, then get steamrolled. <laughs> That's exactly what we call that. That's right, the, the Red Riding Hood character in Darkstalkers, BB Bonnie Hood, of all, of all freaking names. Oh, who to pick? To be real, I'll pick Ugly Ken. Real ugly color. Can't 
Hoppla. Oh, uh, Extreme Machines is your Justin Wong's ratio, Marvel vs. Capcom 2, where each character is assigned points, and your team has to stay under 7 total points. Uh, that's not Justin Wong's idea. I used to be around all the time. He used to do those ratio gimmick tournaments. They were never taken seriously, but they were like side events at major tournaments. And uh, they were fun. Don't get me wrong. They were actually quite fun, um, because it wasn't just all top tier characters. There was no... Fucking MSP team, you know, Magneto, Storm, Psylocke, or Magneto, Storm, uh, Sentinel, and stuff like that. It'd have to be like one good character, maybe like a good assist, and then kind of a low tier crappy character. So, uh, you know, it's a good idea, and absolutely, it does add variety to the game, but it's definitely gimmicky. I mean, why would you limit your character selection if the characters are in the game? You should be able to pick them, right? Oh, uh, what's up, Jax Rasher? He is here. He made it. He did me a dollar fifty. Thank you, Jax. He says. I was able to make it for the second half. How have the matches gone so far? Do you think we'll be finding matches? We've had non-stop matches. There has been some lag and problems, as always, but we have been able to get pretty consistent matches here tonight, which is a good thing, obviously. <clears throat> okay. How dumb they are. Right. Punch him in the nuts as he falls. Very nice. Land on the fist. Back fist. So good to do that. You cancel this fireball and get a back fist to the face. That is awesome. <clears throat> yes, Baby Bonnie Hood was always a weird character. Even in Darkstalker, she's a very odd character. It doesn't really play similarly to the rest of the cast. All right, you got Honda, so I'm definitely not picking uh, Cammy this time. Fuck it. Honda Mirror Match. Sounds like a plan. <clears throat> I did. I did head, but mine doesn't come out. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ah, perfect timing. That was awesome. My move didn't come out. So stupid. I have. Well, he's wide open. It's time to punish him. No move doesn't come out. And that's domination. My <laughs> 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 laugh sounds like ack, ack, ack. So when I laugh, I go, <laughs> or, <laughs> does that sound like ack, 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 ack? No, it sounds nothing like that at all. <laughs> My move didn't come out. What? Oh my god, it did it again! He just does Hail Mary fucking uh, torpedo and I can't do anything about it because of the lag. What the fuck? Complete bullshit. I was completely ready for it. Time to win the match. Just eat the move because the fucking lag. Terrible. Anyway, thank you for an anonymous $10 tipper. He says, just want to say thanks. Your streams always cheer me up when I'm feeling worthless, stupid, or depressed. I think I'm at least I'm not DSP and I feel better about myself. Well, that's good to hear. I'm glad to hear that you think that somehow your life is worse than mine, when in reality mine is infinitely better than yours. Which is probably why you thought you could get some cheap joke laugh or sympathy tonight, when in reality I'm keeping your $10, I'm banning you from being able to contribute ever again because you're a tremendous loser, and I get to continue to play video games and entertain an audience while you sit at home and cry. Big winner. <laughs> oh, nice. Okay. Seriously, how how are there people out there who actually think they're they're like 
They're the winner in an exchange when you paid me to be publicly, uh, you know, embarrassed on a street with hundreds of people on it. <laughs> like, wow. I need th that money. I really do. I need that money. Anyway, I'm bills. still upset about the Honda match because I won it. I actually won the match. My fucking move that would come out. I couldn't even block a, a full screen Hail Mary fucking uh, headbutt. Pretty stupid. <clears throat> $16. Oh, Jay, you're a Godzilla fan? Yeah, I used to be a big Godzilla fan. Um, I used to actually watch some of the more classic movies from back in the days of Blockbuster Video. Yes, I used to rent them. You know who watched them? I remember Biolante, um, Me the Mecha Godzilla movies, um, oh, the, the two different Monster Zero ones, because there's one where he's called Monster Zero, one where he's called Gid King Ghidorah, but it's the same dude. They just renamed him, basically. Um, so if you're going to be an asshole, so definitely be uh, like an asshole, you're going to be shown the uh, door. Stuff. And then later, years later, I actually saw Final Wars, and I really like. So that. So please shut up, this dude Final who's being a, a moron. Uh, a great movie. <clears throat> Pink Blanca. Is studying footage of competition mandatory to be a top player? No. Uh, back in the day, there was no footage. <laughs> There was none. There was no documented blah, stuff blah, on the internet blah, at all to watch. Blah, you had to go to blah, arcades blah, and play blah, people. Blah, 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 That's how you got good back in the day. Blah, 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 um, maybe, maybe today it is mandatory. Maybe it's part of the whole overall experience to just keep doing that. To study the, the footage and stuff. But for me, I'm not going to study nothing. Maybe I'll just study a combo or whatever to see how, how you execute it. But outside of that, no, nah, it's all about the actual hands-on experience for me. <clears throat> Okay. Today's been incredibly slow. Derek says the Godzilla song was really awesome. You mean the most dun 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 dun. You don't aim dun, nothing. Dun 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 dun. Yeah, it's good. I like that song. <laughs> Did you know what Han a Blanca? A Blanca mirror. Nope, he went to Honda, which is a complete counterfeit. I don't care. I'll still win. What? It dropped my input. You could even see the frame of animation was completely dropped. Complete bullshit. It starts skipping right in the middle of the match so I can't get my fucking combo. Get the fuck out of here. What? Look at that! Look at that giant job frame of animation. Greed is massively strong. What? Oh my god, he randomly does a move and it drops my input again, so I can't do anything about it. Good night. Kevin, thank you for the super chat. He says, will a computer win a Street Fighter tournament? I took a question. It, maybe it could. Maybe it could be like, uh, was it a deep blue fucking computer that they had that was beating everyone in chess? Maybe, maybe uh, there could be a Street Fighter computer. I don't know. Derek says, "What about the Blue Oyster Cult song?" Oh, oh I do. Go, go, Godzilla! 
pain now. They say he's got to go, 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 Godzilla. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I remember that song. I'm gonna probably switch lobbies after this. I've been kicking these guys' butts. Excuse me. What? Three moves didn't come out in a row. I can't jump forward. I seriously can't. What the? <laughs> oh, I think we have a problem here. Literally all my moves drop. I didn't. What is going on? Thank you. Fucking ridiculous, man. Give me my moves. <clears throat> wow, what a moron. Maybe you shouldn't have just stood still. Paid attention, dumbass. Oh, come on now. You're giving me fucking crazy lag. No tiger uppercut. No tiger uppercut again. What the fuck, dude? How am I supposed to do anything about this insane lag? <laughs> the lag is so bad. Jesus, I'm definitely leaving this room now. Fuck this, dude. The room's out of control, insanely laggy. Fucking shit. Oh, all right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are roughly. Halfway through tonight's Friday Night Fight stream, you even though it's not Friday Night Fight, game. it's Street Fighter Saturday Night Slams, or Smackdowns, or whatever we want to call it. Uh, I hope you guys are having fun. We got about, like I said, another hour left on the stream. Thank you to everyone who's engaged the stream. We have over 50 people who have already liked it. We have over 200 people watching. So if you're enjoying this stream, please give it a like. I My don't goal have is 100 to do likes it. I don't have money to do 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 it. Say watching DSP gaming, but maybe they're searching for said content. They're like, oh, I want some old school Street Fighter. I'll what, show up with search results do? if I have enough engagement. So please like the stream if you're enjoying tonight's stream. In addition, please consider contributing in any way, shape, or form, whether that be a super chat, a super sticker, a membership, or a tip. Currently, thank you, Kevin, for the the uh, super chats. You've done a, a few tonight. Um, and thank you, guitar player, for the current top tip of $4.20. We're at $14 in tips. Now, guys, you know I like doing Street Fighter, all right? $14 is not cool, all right? <laughs> so you're just being honest here. I always do better than that. So it would be great if we can get some more. Remember, we have goals in effect. Gunner glasses at $50 of, half of your choice at $100. It sure would be great if we can get some more contributions tonight, okay? Please consider it, especially if you like the stuff. All right, please consider. All right. I'm just stretching out my hands here before I begin. So when you're playing Street Fighter, I'm going to make sure your hands are okay. loose and stretched. Fair enough. Now, like I said, I get the feeling All I right. am getting carpal tunnel. Ah, stretch them out as much as possible before we resume. There we go. <sighs> Nuno Gloop, I don't care a fuck about Tekken, so please don't even fucking derail this room with nonsense like that. <clears throat> okay. Okay. New lobby. Yes. I Bubbly Rips is in the room before, but not the other two, I don't think, so. Okay. That's correct. Please don't ask for certain people to contribute when they already have as well. Jax was already here earlier and tipped on the earlier stream to help out with Elden Ring, so please stop with the nonsense. It's not your, not your place to be asking people to contribute to my streams. And you will not be here for long if you, you uh, act like that. <clears throat> Why am I ah. toxic? Good. Penis Parker, why would I play Godfather Part 2 again? What on earth are you even talking about? What? <sighs> Only fear of death, it's a double-edged sword. He says, what do you think about the fact? Here, I'll start recording to answer this. So we're heading into our second hour of gameplay tonight, guys. I need that and Only fear of death asks an interesting question while we wait for my match. He says, 
What are your thoughts about strategies and secrets today? They're shared instantly in fighting on. games on the online, as opposed to back in the day, everyone would keep it a secret and have an edge in tournaments. It's a it's a double-edged sword, and here's why. You're absolutely right. Back then, as I already stated on this stream, there was no online footage, there was no documentation of things that were done in tournaments, and because of that, um, you had to be there to learn anything. You would have to watch tournament level matches or play against tournament level players to learn strategies or how to counter them. There was no, oh, I watched someone's stream, I watched someone's on-demand video and saw the footage back. But that being said, okay, um, because knowledge was kept so tight-lipped and under wraps just for competition, essentially games had a longer lifespan. What I mean by that is a game like Marvel vs. Capcom 2, the first year or two years, wow. every character Forest. in the game was viable. Then people started Jeeve to utilize Ivan. the higher tier strategies like cable is now a and people way. Then people started to utilize more rushdown strategies like Magneto, Storm, Sentinel. And that was an evolution of anywhere from two to five years of gameplay until the game finally hit its like, creative wall. You see what I'm saying? Marvel vs. Capcom 2 never had an update. It was always the same game, but the gameplay was constantly evolving because it was a slow build over time as people played each other and figured out these strategies. Today, here's the double-edged sword. All the strategies are online right away and everyone can know them. You've already met the creative or uh, the competitive meta of the game within like a week. In one week, you know what's top tier in every fucking fighting game. And now everyone just does it ad nauseum. It's, it's actually, in my opinion, kind of disappointing. Back in the day, there was always this, this whole time period of discovery and exploration and trying to figure out what was good and viable in the game. But now you know it within a day. It's just all over the internet. But you can do you guys. Completely locked down. Shout out to Captain Ahab who took me four dollars and sixty nine cents. I appreciate that, Captain Ahab. Not what I did. Jesus Christ, he got demolished. Barlog. He quit. He quit the lobby. Did you see that shit? I beat him so bad he quit the lobby. He had enough. <laughs> Damn. That's a fucking spanking and a half. He quit the fucking game. That is the top tip. Captain Ahab is the top tip. My bad. I didn't have time to update the leaderboard. Thanks for shouting that out. I'll have to fix that. Super. I don't have money to do it. 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 I down back. I was down backing and the game apparently says I got hit. Right. Zero skill, maximum profit. I didn't do a turn punch. I didn't do that, I did a headbutt. Wow, the game is dropping all my inputs. <laughs> it's dropping a lot of inputs. Of course! What the f- He threw through my move. Just think about it. <laughs> he got insanely lucky with tons of his hits. Seriously. Ridiculous amounts of luck. Absolutely ridiculous amounts of fucking luck. You just stand here doing low, low medium kick, low medium kick, low medium kick. Oh, I'm gonna randomly mash a button. Oh, I gotta throw. I wasn't even near you when you matched the button. <laughs> Jesus. All right, next time around, I won't fuck around. I probably won't even use the turn punch. I have two different ways that I play Balrog. I have a way where I try to play fancy with the turn punches. I have another way where I say, fuck this. And I just play Smash Mouth Balrog. 
In which case, I just beat the shit out of you with a lot of sweeps and shit. And that's the more effective way to play Balrog. But I actually like playing more fancy with the turn punches. But I do better without them. So, fuck enough of all that bullshit now. Oh, thank you to Kevin. He's in the super chat. I wanted to say you're doing... Wait, what? I can't read it. I wanted to say keep doing your best. All right, thank you, Kevin. You'll get there. I hope... I hope... That, yes, all the years and years of hard work will eventually pay off and I'll get in a situation where, you know, everything gets stable for me. That's really my goal. And I was actually th about to be there last year when the whole bullshit with Twitch and partner program nonsense happened. Um, which is unfortunate because if that hadn't happened, probably right now I'd be in a crazy good position. Seriously. But they really fucked me over with what they did. <clears throat> Excuse me. Wow, Jay says he's watched every Godzilla movie, 1954 to 2021. That's a lot. No, no word on, on the gifted memberships on, on YouTube. They've not updated anything. They're not, they haven't added it yet. They have zero word. It's hilarious that last year, in the fall, they made the big announcement. Oh, we're doing all these improvements to streaming. Really, that's what, you know, if, if, if the insinuation was that they paid those top guys. Who was it? Dr. Lupo and uh, Tim the Tatman to exclusively stream on YouTube. And that what they were going to do as a result, they were going to improve the streaming situation. And they announced all of those different improvements they were going to do. And then they never did any of them. That was, you real, guys realize, that was like six months ago when they said that those improvements were coming, right? And they still haven't happened. It's like, dude, why even announce anything if you have absolutely no time, plan, time frame or plan to implement any of it? Just don't say it at all until you're ready. Grow up. <clears throat> Yeah, Neon, no one even understands how Super Thanks work. For those who don't know, Super Thanks is the ability for someone watching an on-demand video on YouTube to say, oh, I really like that. And just how you guys right I'm now can say, do a, 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 a Super Chat or a Super Sticker during a live stream. I don't have money to do it. 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 It's highlighted forever on that video with, I guess, your Super Thanks attached to it. Saying, oh, you know, great playthrough or whatever. And... It's a way to help out a content creator who does on-demand videos as opposed to just streaming. Um, but there's absolutely no way to get it. There's none. YouTube has not rolled it out site-wide. It's been in beta for like over a year and they still haven't launched it. Um, which is really stupid in my opinion. Why not just fucking launch it and fix it rather than just not have it at all? Uh, apparently what, what is happening is they literally just do a random lottery. Um, <clears throat> and random people just get it out of nowhere. And I think what it is is they don't want to announce it as a full thing because they don't want everyone to want it and then have a bunch of bugs I or something. I need but that money. I really it's do. It's weird I that, that it, it literally is a random lottery. I talked to YouTube about it back in January. I said, I would love to try it out and be one of the people to, to, to do the beta for it. And they said, basically, no, there's no way to do that. We just give it to people randomly. And eventually everyone will get it. Don't worry. So, whatever. Can't do anything about it. <clears throat> Haseo says, remember Beyond Good and Oh, we remember Beyond Good and Evil 2? By the time it gets a release date, we're going to have PS6. Yeah, I don't think we're getting it. I think the game, honestly, if you want to know my the truth, I don't think we're ever getting it. I think it's it basically is like in limbo. It's not being developed. Or else we would have had some information about it by now. <clears throat> oh, shitty Alpha 3. Ugh! Oh, why? Shitty, laggy Alpha 3. Uh, listen, oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. How the fuck am I supposed to play this? You've got to be kidding me. Why am I even fucking playing at this point?
Amazing. Yikes. <laughs> anyway, I got Show Ryukin back in the lobby. That's cool. Haseo says, that hopefully the Darkstalkers uh, collection won't have the lag issues you're having with the Street Fighter collection. Yeah, I hope so. Because I would like to play Vampire Savior. I would definitely like to play Hyper Street Fighter 2 uh, Anniversary Edition. Uh, maybe one of the other two gimmick games that are in there. But those are the two that I'm more primarily focused on playing in that collection coming out in June. And they did not hire Digital Eclipse to do it. They have a different company who made the collection. I guess they realized this collection sucks so fucking hard they wanted someone else to make this one. So that's good. Okay, guys, we're at 76 likes and climbing. Again, uh, it would be absolutely awesome if you guys could please like the stream if you're having a good time with it. Please do, okay? <clears throat> okay. It's rising to uh, toxicity. <laughs> la, 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 la. Of course, also, if you guys are having a good time, please consider contributing to the stream to support it, considering there's only $22 in tips tonight. We've still got about 45 minutes or so of gameplay. It would be great if we could get that higher. Derek says, time flies. It's been almost four years since the collection came out. Keep May 28, 2018. Not really. Time doesn't fly. This collection's been out for a long time. I've been playing it for an F and long Feel time. Your levels it doesn't seem like that time flew by very fast, especially when the collection basically was never really good. Even at launch, it wasn't great. Um... If you remember, we were playing Ultra Street Fighter 2 before that, dick. which was fun until everyone abused the fucking character that shouldn't have been in it, and then it became a complete waste of everybody's time. Haseo says, because I'm enjoying Elden Ring, will I play future DLCs? If they do have future major story-based DLCs, I likely would. Yeah, I likely would. It's, it's the same vibe for me as, like, uh, you know, Bloodborne. Well, I, actually, let me put it this way. It's more like Dark Souls 2 and 3. Dark Souls 2 and 3, not only did I love the games when they were new, but then I went ahead and I played the DLCs as soon as they came out. Bloodborne, actually, I liked the game, but I didn't want to play the DLC because it was the fall, the busy gaming season, and I wanted to play all the other games. Everyone demanded, literally demanded that I played it. And then when I did, I basically flubbed it, didn't care, and never even got past Ludwig. So, uh, yeah, in my opinion, I think that Elden Ring DLC would probably be, be good, and I probably would enjoy it a lot more than, say, the Bloodborne DLC. Did they even announce that they're doing DLC? Not aware of that. What's up, Jim? He says, weird to me play Street Fighter on Saturday. <laughs> so, basically, when you think about it, this collection will turn four years old and then immediately be retired because the new one's coming out in June. The one that will replace it. <laughs> old Ken again. All these old Kens, right? Old Ken Marathon tonight. Who to use? Who to, oh, I didn't use Dawson at all tonight. I just realized. I didn't use him once.
Right. Yo, what the? Oh my god! <laughs> Are you shitting me? Twice he hit my limbs. Oh my god. This is ridiculous at this point. Yeah. Basically, he's getting away with just spamming Shoryuki. And he's not timing it. He's literally just doing Shoryuken, Shoryuken. And I can't do anything about it. I'm trying to either go around it or even like that last at the end. You could do wake up teleport and get right away from it. Yeah, it's stupid. It's basically anyone who spams overpowered shit like that online. It's very hard to beat in a laggy game like this. Um, I'm trying to have fun with fucking Dalsim and he's just like, oh, sure you can. Oh, sure you can. And he just hits everything. You're a great player. Jade, I'm glad that you enjoy uh, my Street Fighter stuff. Don't worry, I'll get him. If he, if he keeps winning, I'll get his ass. I just won't fuck around. I'll just pick a good character and beat his ass. Fucking stupid. I'm just going to fucking pick old Ken and do massive amounts of jab dragon punch. Ho ho! Oh my god, the jump kick! Damn, man. All you need to do is roundhouse. He had him. I agree, Jim. I think the Kirby was perfect last night. I can't wait for more tomorrow. Frieza, thanks for stopping by and checking out the Street Fighter stuff, man. He never really doesn't watch the Street Fighter. He thought, what the heck? It's it's fun. It's it, The lag is unfortunate when it happens because this collection, actually, or collection is not that good. Um, in that regard, but it's actually fun to see me, you know, in, play a variety of stuff and play games that I actually know what the hell I'm doing. <clears throat> oh, good. Oh, he quit. Oh, he fucking quit like a bitch because he knew he was going to have to rematch me and I was going to dominate his ass, so he fucking quit. <laughs> Alright, I'll just go back to fucking Dalsim then. I don't have to worry about the spammer. I did. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what you do to, kick the, to hit that kick. I forget which button it is. Maybe to your back medium kick or maybe down medium punch. I oh, can't remember. Stinky foot. Very nice. <laughs> well, I get to play Show Ryugan, but sadly, uh, then we have to leave because Jose's here to ruin our, our night. Show Ryugan's the really good uh, Dudley player. Damn, I haven't played him in so long. I haven't played him in so long, he's probably gonna fuck me up. He's probably been playing a lot, and I've, you know, I haven't played this Dudley in a million years. Are you ready? Go! No uppercut, huh? That was a good one. Bottom. All right, Derek. See you tomorrow. Prepare to strike now. Good throw. Thanks, Derek. I appreciate it. Good mix that. up. Perry. Good mix up again. Beautiful. Everything was a mix up in the corner. Final round. Engage. Good move. Mix 
Close fight. Super close. It's been pretty slow. Very good. And I gotta leave because Jose crashes the fucking lobby for everybody. Sucks. Kirby is tomorrow night, Yonko. Kirby is tomorrow night. Yes. This is the new Kirby on the schedule. It's tomorrow. Uh, late stream, 6.45 p.m. Jade, I'm not necessarily in love with Ghostwire Tokyo, but I do like it. Uh, I thought it was, I was intrigued by it yesterday, and I can't wait for more of it tomorrow to see what it, what it turns out to be. This is not good, because take a look. I can't find lobbies now, and this means one of two things. It either means that basically the night is winding down, which sucks, or it means that the game is crashing, which happens sometimes. There's been entire nights where all of a sudden no one seems to be playing the game out of nowhere. Like, where did everyone go? Uh, and it really is because the servers are fucked up. So hopefully that's not the case, but uh, I'm getting a little nervous here, as you can see. What is going on? They're trying to ready what, up. What do I, I do? Works. Oh, there's Jose, so I gotta quit. I don't think it was working anyway, by the way. It's still in there. See, it is. It's glitched out right now. The game likely is crapping out. This happens sometimes, which is not good. If this really is the case, we could try swapping over to Xbox. I don't know how if that's going to work at this late uh, time of the night. Ugh. Ooh. Ooh. Challenge myself. I'll see him against Honda. Very tough fight. Got him. Completely zoned him. <clears throat> oh my god, what a terrible trade. <laughs> the basic there's ways around that with honda by the way he just doesn't know them but that's the basic zoning with uh Dalcine. and i gotta quit because there's jose of course <clears throat> all right let's see if this lobby works it might not sounds good derek i'll see you for kirby tomorrow It's not working. This lobby's crapped out. As you can see, nothing is moving. When there's nothing moving at all, it usually means that the lobby's completely fucked up. So. Ugh. Shit. Is this lobby working? Uh. <laughs> Come on. I don't think so. Come on! Oh my god, they're not readying up. I don't know what's going on. Shitty Alcatraz. You picked the Geefster. I might as well pick Bison where there's no hope of hitting the tip skull tonight, which sucks, so I'll just pick Bison.
He just keeps doing body splash. In this game, the body splash with Zangief has a broken ass hitbox. You can almost never hit it. <clears throat> See? Oh my god, he hit me with a fucking throw from that distance. Yes, that was perfect. Guard break into throw. Woo! Very nice. I think this guy's not playing. He's sitting in lobby and literally not readying up ever or playing. So people think that the lobby's broken when he's just being stupid. Same thing? Okay. Let's get to play. My laugh sounds like ack, ack, ack. So when I laugh and I go, <laughs> or, <laughs> does that sound like ack, 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 ack? No. It's not looking like that at all. So I got against Dalsim. Oh, here we go. Now he's talking about WWE Champion. She was a piece of shit. You piece of donkey shit. How about this? How about this? WWE Champion. All right. WWE Champion lives rent free in your motherfucking head. I don't think about WWE Champion. You do. You probably know way more about the fucking game than I ever will. Hunch. You're an idiot. You're an obsessed loser. No, Jim, I don't know Shoryuken from my pro days, but I've played with him over the years in this collection. Tiger, Tiger, row, 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 Tiger, row, row. I don't want that at all. There's a sick motherfucker on the internet called Super Hound, whatever the fuck this idiot's name is. Kick, kick. I don't have money to do it. 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 I appreciate the ongoing support. Oh my god. I'm probably gonna lose. I think Rose personally is quite bad against Zangief because his fucking stupid uh, splash beats almost all her moves. But I'm gonna give it a shot. I don't know how it's gonna go. Thank you, Hoseo. Biggest tip of the night. What the fuck? Okay. A whale! Oh, that's cool! Can't get my move! I can't do anything. I can't even block it. Yeah, I can't block it. He's just doing jump punch. It won't let me block it. This fucking game is so dumb. I can't. I seriously can't get out of the way. I can't do a fucking super. It won't come out. This is a joke.
See? There's no hitbox on the fucking splash. You can't hit it. And I can't get the fucking super to come out. It's so easy. Why am I getting hit? I'm not even near the fucking guy. No super. No super. I just don't have to do anything but jumping fierce. What the fuck? I'm in the middle of a fucking move. What? <laughs> the game is so broken. The game is so terrible. Have some salt. I can't get my fucking super to come out ever. I'm just doing two quarter circle K. Two quarter circle K. Two quarter circle K. It never fucking comes out because the game is a piece of dog shit. And then he just, oh, splash, punt, splash, punt, splash, punt, splash, punt. I can't do anything about it. I, I There's nothing you can do because the game is terrible. Alpha 3 itself is a terrible game and then you're playing it online with even worse connection. What an amazing fucking gameplay experience that was, huh? Wow, what a, what a really skillful player. And I got him, and I'm, he's open, and I can't do anything because the fucking game sucks. I hate Alpha 3. I've told you guys this, like, out of all, not, not only the games in this collection, but just the old school Street Fighter games, it's the worst. It's fucking terrible. And people sucked its butt back then. They were kissing its ass up, down, left, and right when the game actually is terrible. I don't care. Some of the worst hitbox, the, the worst priority of any competitive Street Fighter game. You can't do nothing about half the shit in the game either. It's so bro, if you're not playing top tier, you might as well not play at all. It's fucking such a dumb game. Oh, yeah, yeah. anything. I don't think you can do anything in the fight because Balrog has no low attacks besides sweet, so I think he can get away with doing what he's doing. I can't stop the headbutt at all. I can't punish it. Oh? It's super ridiculous. You can just keep holding back. I should nothing I can really do. What, what do I do? That was the dumbest fucking match ever. <laughs> but I learned crouching fierce punch what, stopped what his hundred hand slap. He was doing the hundred hands and crossing fierce actually stuffed it. I uh I don't know why it stuffed it, but it did. Here we go again. So I'm definitely not picking Oh, never mind. And now it's Jose, right? Oh yeah, look, the lobby crashed. I can't even move. Look at this. No, I never I didn't see any of the Venom movies, Jay. Nope. <clears throat> Try this again. Castro Jenkins says, if you had to only choose out of the two to play in tournament, which would you play, Street Fighter 5 or Alpha 3? Of course, Alpha 3, because I've played Alpha 3, and I at least know some stuff in it. Street Fighter 5, Street Fighter 5 I don't even understand anymore, because I haven't played the last three or four years of it, because the game is so bad. I just didn't care to learn it. So obviously I'm going to play what I know. It doesn't mean I'm going to like it. It means I'm just going to play what I know. <clears throat> Jim the Frog is, what's the last movie I saw in theaters? The last movie I saw in theaters. I've only seen one movie in theaters with my wife. And it was before she was my wife. And it was Spider-Man Homecoming. Spider-Man Homecoming. Yep. <laughs> oh, 
and there's Jose. <laughs> Oy, oy, oy. You rip hill, and that's it, because you're just gonna waste our time again. Double strike! That was flame kick. It said he jumped, which I never did. I never jumped at all. I'm doing the flame kick, that backwards fucking sure you can kick. Why is he jumping? Piece of shit. Full super to face. Very nice. Oh my god. This this is the what the second time in a row I'm playing on PlayStation and the whole game's falling apart at the end, right? I played for almost two full hours and now it's this bad. It's like unplayable. Fucking terrible. The uh, Ziggy Piggy is a match against Shell Ryuki. That would be nice. Oh shit, I almost picked fucking Alpha 3. Oops. Alright. Are you ready? Go! Got him. Are you ready? Go. Jesus, you think they did enough counter hit damage right there? Great. That was not what I did. I didn't do a jab. What the hell was that? I did neutral jump short. Yeah, I'm sure I did that. Almost had it. It's only five hits and then the six, and then you get a full combo after. Final round. Go for it. Ain't nothing I can do. I'm stuck in the corner. Stuck in the corner and I can't I can't react fast enough to the mix up he's doing online. <clears throat> what really sucks is I could have parried his whole move in the second round and, and beaten him with a comeback combo, but online the game says no you can't do that, even though I did it properly. Because <laughs> the game sucks. <clears throat> yeah, Shobu Yuki's mix ups are quite good. It's uh high low mix ups. And uh, online, very hard to counter for sure. A little bit easier to counter offline. Um, I'm not saying I would beat him offline either because I'm not very good with Akuma regardless. But uh, yeah, it's tricky stuff. Jade says, we are Venom. Interestingly enough, I never used to read Venom comics. 
Well, I first got exposure to him saying We Are Venom when I played Marvel vs. Capcom 1. He was a character in it. And he would actually, at the beginning of the match, said, We Are Venom. It was pretty cool. Oh, I just can't get a break to end the stream tonight. I can't. They won't let me play the game. They will not let me play this fucking game tonight. Unbelievable. It's the second time in a row I played on PlayStation and we're having the same issues. <laughs> Unfucking Ugh. <laughs> 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 Why not go back to the Xbox? What's the point? The stream's only going for about another 15, 20 minutes. There's no point in switching consoles now. <laughs> Didn't play with old Bach tonight. Salt levels while the hat is born. <laughs> what the fuck? There we go. That's much better. Wow. It's been pretty slow. Close fight. <laughs> and they're gonna make these guys more business. They're making the these guys are making the Kawabunga collection. They are. Digital Eclipse is making the Ninja Turtles Kawabunga Collection, and they're going to be charging $40 for it. Do you think it's going to work? Judging what their fucking track record, do you really think the game is going to fucking work? Let's be honest here. <laughs> He's already in here. I need those. He's already money. in the lobby. I, really do. I need that money to pay my bills. Oh my god, dude. Oh my fucking lord. This is atrociously stupid at this point. Are you fucking joking me? I literally can't play anyone now. It's just glitch, 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 glitch. Jesus fucking Christ. I can't get a single match. If I could get down on my hands and knees and say thank you and still be on camera, I would do it. Oh. Blah 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 blah. The turtles are not in charge of the new Street Fighter collection. They're making the Ninja Turtles collection. People are asking, but they don't understand. They watch me play this every week. Okay, for four years. Uh huh. See how bad it is, right? You see, runs at the wrong speed, full of lag, constant bugs. No, no actual proper matchmaking. No way to kick someone out of your lobby who's a troll. All these issues. They say, why is Digital Eclipse getting more business? I and why are they going to do it? I don't have money to do it. I don't have money to do it. Because game publishers are fucking idiots. I don't have money to do it. I don't have money to do it. They're so dumb and ignorant. 
They never af- asked. They didn't ask anyone. Gee, what do you think of the 30th anniversary they collection? Said, Phil, you know, we could you ask a competitive you, player about this like collection. It's a black thing. This thing is a because piece it always of shit. seems like no matter how much it we lacks contribute, all the essential you're always functions, still having a terrible job. They absolutely and, and should have done much better. better. And they should have. I agree with time to make it function better instead of dropping it after six months. Um, but they don't ask. They're morons. They don't. They oh, this is the company that just makes all the collections, right? All right, let's contract them to do the Kyle Bunga collection. But did you look at their previous work? Did you ask the players who play it if it's good? Or did you just say, oh, there's a few sales. They made, they got a few sales under their belt. Let's just hire them to do our work too, right? They're morons. These fucking idiots in charge of these companies have no fucking brain for what they're doing. They're just a bunch of corporate wigs who fucking, you know, they put on a suit and they think they know anything about fucking video games. They don't play the fucking games. They just sit there and divvy the fucking money out. They don't know shit. They didn't actually play this collection after it came out. They just counted their fucking profits. <laughs> That's how they know it sucks. They're stupid. I accidentally picked this one. I want a third strike. Okay, at least we're playing third strike. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Are you ready? Go. That hurts. Oh my god, that's not what I wanted! Ah! <laughs> ah! Wow, two counters, look at the damage. No super, interesting. No super again, that's twice in a row I had him. Jesus. Wow. Jesus, so close. He paired my low short and did a counter hit for insane damage. Go for it. I didn't do that. I didn't do fireball. Got him. Close fight. Very close. You win. Honda. Hmm. Shall I challenge myself? Ziggy yeah, let's talk about this. Zach. Now that's a challenge Thanks, right there. That's Thank a hard matchup. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> it's been pretty slow. Ow again. Ah! You know how I said this was a counter match for me and I was challenging myself? <laughs> yeah. He literally do headbutts the whole fucking round. Yes. I need that money. I really do. I need that money to pay my bills. Yeah, 
Yes, the comeback of legends. <laughs> the comeback of legends. Holy shit, that was a crazy good comeback. Damn. 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 That was a good one. Damn. <laughs> All right, we got time for like one or two more matches. If we can even get them, we'll have to see. How do I feel about Tiny Tina Wonderlands? I have no desire to play it. It's, it's fucking Borderlands 3. It's literally Borderlands 3 with some fantasy twists and a little bit of, you know, story changes. But it's the same game, so why would I want to play Borderlands 3 again and pay money for it? Especially because I heard they're charging a lot of money, right? Isn't it like 60 bucks or something? Like, why would I want that again? I've already played it. <laughs> I didn't even really like Borderlands 3 that much. Oh, yeah, Jade says, first time we saw Venom was the Spider-Man animated series in the 1990s. I watched Spider-Man. I remember I remember the theme song a lot. I don't think I saw all the episodes, though. I, I was always about X-Men, and then I was about uh, Batman animated series and uh, stuff like that. Justice League, Gargoyles, that kind of stuff. I think Spider-Man I watched when, I, when it was on, but I didn't get to see it all the time. Frieza, typically when we do a Street Fighter stream, uh, there's a couple regulars that will tip. In particular, Jax Raxer is one of them, but Jax Raxer actually came by earlier today because he wasn't sure if he could make the stream, so it applied to my earlier stream, and so, quite frankly, we probably would have easily made $50 or more tonight, but it already applied to the earlier stream, so. <clears throat> hint, hint, hint. All right, guys, so, last few minutes, I'm going to try to get a few more matches into end tonight's stream. Hopefully, we can get a few. Uh, thanks for being a great audience. It would be great last minute if you enjoyed tonight's stream, if you could like it. We're trying to hit 100 likes on the stream. We're at 87. We're very close to what I, I look for for a goal. Uh, it would be great. Any last minute contributions, whether they be super chats, memberships, tips, anything would help. And it would be great to see something. So thank you to anyone who does contribute in any way. <clears throat> Ooh. Good game show, you can. Yes, they were good matches. He said he got to work early tonight, which is why he was able to get a few matches in. It was good to see you. It was good to hang with you a little bit. This collection is about to be done. So this is like the last hurrah. I know you love Third Strike, and, you know, I, I love playing you in Third Strike. But, yeah, it's going to be done soon. Just another, what, month and a half? And then the new collection will be out, and uh, it'll be all about Darkstalkers and... Hyper Street Fighter 2. <clears throat> I think Shoryuken is, is on my friends list. I think he actually is. I don't remember. I think back in the day I added him. Mark McCauley says, I got a gold trophy for doing a 90% damage King of Fighters 15 combo. I think the game I think the game has enormous damage combos to make the game unbalanced. Do you agree? It's just a bad game engine. It just is at this point. The fact that they designed the game to have them in there like that and they think that it's valid for a competitive game means that it's just a badly designed game. Sad but true. <clears throat> the hell is going on here? <laughs> oh. Hmm. Right. All that bullshit on the titles or the select screen just to see a fucking Shoto match. <laughs> Let's go crazy! Oh, look, Ken versus Ryu. Never seen this one before. Oh. <laughs> Naginata or Naginta, you're talking about Rogue. Rogue is the one that absorbs people's powers by touching them and gets super strength. <clears throat> The only reason Rogue has Super Strange is because once she killed someone, she absorbed all of their powers and the person died. I forget who it was. But, uh, yeah. And so that person had Super Strange and she permanently absorbed the Super Strange and never loses it now. Can someone please shut up this dude who's being a, a moron? This is riveting stuff. Who's stronger, Ryu or Ken? Ryu. Ken, Ken has higher combo ability. 
and therefore can have overall better damage output than Ryu, but Ryu deals more base damage than Ken. Captain Marvel? Was it? Oh shit, it was the original Captain Marvel. So the original Captain Marvel was fought by Rogue and Rogue touched, touched the, uh, Captain Marvel and absorbed all the powers and killed it. And then she became a superpowered being. Permanently. Great, I guess this really is my last match. This fucking Jose is back again. Fucking piece of shit. Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know. One button dash is playing Oblivion. He likes better than Skyrim. He hopes he gets a rematch for someday. It would be great if it did. Skyrim got 400. Alrighty then. Oh my god, that was it and it didn't come out. Good show. Stalking my prey. What, what do I do? What do I do? Special delivery! Special delivery! Oh my god. You know, maybe if he had actually tried to attack me, he might have come back. He didn't even try. My laugh sounds like ack, ack, ack. So when I laugh and I go, or, All right, guys, <laughs> that's going to be it for tonight. Does that sound like... Uh, act, 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 sorry we couldn't act, get consistently act. good no, matches. It was about like 90 minutes of good stuff, and then it kind of fell apart there the last half an hour, but that seems to be a running pattern now, doesn't it? This is the third week in a row where we uh, kind of had that issue. Um, I'm almost thinking we should go back to Xbox next week and see what happens. Thank you to those who did chill and did support and did engage. Uh, it is what it is. We didn't hit the 100 likes. We didn't get any more tips or support. Uh, <laughs> I think this will get a little bit more interest once the new collection comes out in June. The problem is we're still in the end of March, so we still have like two plus it's months been to, pretty go to get there. Not gonna lie, um, I still love doing it, but uh, it was a little bit of a deflating stream for the support and also the fact that the last half hour sucked. So, all right. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching and chilling with me, old school Street Fighter. Appreciate that. Okay. All right, guys. That's it for tonight. Thanks for chilling with me. I'm going to upload the gameplay as usual to the channel. Remember that tomorrow is a completely different day. It's going to be Ghostwire Tokyo on the first stream. And then it's going to be more of Kirby and the Forgotten Land on the late stream. I'm intrigued to see what's coming in Ghostwire. And Kirby is just a freaking outstanding game. So I can't wait to play more of that. Hope you guys will come and uh, chill with me tomorrow. All right. If you're interested in more Elden Ring, that's Monday. And I don't know what I'm doing Monday night yet. I may do a poll uh, probably tomorrow to determine what you guys want Monday night. It could be anything. It could be uh, Ghostwire. It could be Kirby. It could be uh, maybe Skyrim. You know, I'm kind of open to it, whatever, depending on what people want. So, all right, guys, that is it for tonight. Thank you. Please have a good one. And I hope to see you tomorrow for some fun stuff. Sound good? All right, guys. Peace out. Have a good night. <clears throat>
say goodbye. All right, everyone's gone, and now I will reveal all of the secrets of behind the scenes of streaming on YouTube that no one knows because the stream is over and no one could possibly hear me say them. <laughs> Are you a functional retard? I have to ask. Gout, 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 fatty, fat, fuck, fuck.
it's been pretty slow.
my laugh sounds like ack, ack, ack. So when I laugh and I go, ha, 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 or ha, 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 does that sound like ack, 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 ack? No, it sounds nothing like that at all. Oh, no, you didn't, you motherfucking piece of shit cocksucker. Mark my fucking words. I'm coming for you. I'm going to find out who the fuck you are. You motherfucker. You are fucked. Let this be noticed live on the internet. You're fucked. And you are done. I need th that money. I really do. I need that money to pay my bills. I love Hulk Hogan's dick.